the gut buster. There we go. Yeah, it's right there. If I got you, just make sure it stays back. I'll turn them Yeah, just around your belt. That's like totally turning your butt cheek to yeah. the target. Yeah, and that's the thing. It's like you could stand here and it's like turn that right, right back pocket at the target and go around your waist. So I don't care if it actually, the knee straightens in relation to where it starts. I just don't want more down. So just slightly down. It's definitely stable. And you'll feel it in that right there too. And then you'll be able to fire that. Yep. It's real stable, so don't let the weight go to the outside of your left, your right foot. Just go, just go inside the heel. Yep. Ooh, that's awesome. That is awesome. Is that different there, Sandy? Yeah. Okay. Because once you can do that, then it's like you're going around your belt loop on the back swing. Then you can unwind it. Yep. Good. Better. Really good. Ooh, great. That's awesome. Good. And then we'd go, once you're here, then it'd be baseball. Yeah, I didn't do baseball. It's okay. I mean, it's just little feels here and there. That's all right. Step by step by step, as opposed to just like, yes, I know. That's all right, that's all right. And that's the thing one of the things, just at home, if you just put that hand on your pocket and you just go around, you just do that motion and feel the weight pivot into the heels really, both heels. Yeah, there you go. Good, there you go. That's all right. That's a, I know it's a lot of work. You want to see what it looks like? Nope, not yet. Okay. Well, it wasn't a good hit, but was it better technique? Yeah, it's coming around more. That's right. It's going to be a little focus on both back. And I'm going to let you see it. Here, here. 